Now to the future of flight chatters. Natalia Rizak is here to take a deep dive into the latest on solar powered planes that really could just stay in the air for months. Right, Natalia? Good morning to you. That's right, Hannah. Good morning. This next generation solar powered plane could quite literally change the future. Here's what you need to know. In 2016, the Solar Impulse 2 circumnavigated the globe in over 500 days, or about 15 months. Now that might sound unimpressively slow, but the Impulse 2 did it without a single drop of fuel. The plane was a result of over 13 years of work by modern day explorer Bertrand Picard and engineer and pilot Andre Borschberg. The Solar Impulse 2 is powered in part by four lithium batteries and only weighs around 5,000 pounds, which for reference is about the weight of an SUV. But its wingspan is longer than a jumbo jet. These wings include an array of over 17,000 photovoltaic solar cells, which also power the plane. But the plane does have its limitations. First, the plane averages a speed between 28 to 56 miles per hour. It also has to reduce flight height at night due to darkness and can't fly during inclement weather. So why did startup Skydweller Aero purchase Solar Impulse in 2018? Well, the plane's most practical use might not involve air travel at all. Skydweller is testing to see if they can remove pilots and add systems that could have the aircraft fly automatically. If successful, the plane could remain in the air for extended periods of time, and that could have real-world impacts. Skydweller has partnered with Telefonica, one of the world's largest mobile carriers, with hopes of using the planes to expand cellular coverage in underserved regions. And the impulse could also be used for rescue operations, location scouting, or Earth imaging. Skydweller's CEO is setting his sights on a possible deployment of these aircraft as early as 2023. And the U.S. Navy has also invested millions in this to see if this project could be a proper alternative to drone technology, which would be a massive, massive deal. Natalia, thank you so much for joining us this morning.